Okay, so it says, what is the prime factorization of 12? Now, what is prime factorization? That means um, factors, factors are numbers multiplied. So it's not going to be this one or this one, right? Because those are added. That's not right. These are added. That's, that's just simply not what factorization means. Factorization means to write it multiplied. So, okay. So, so it's not those. Well, which, which of the other two is it? And then the other thing is it's got to be prime. Remember what prime, you may know what prime numbers are. Anybody remember, what are primes? Prime numbers are numbers that can't be multiplied to get itself. Yeah, numbers that can't be broken down anymore with multiplication, that's right. Yeah, primes are numbers that can, um, can let's say it this way, uh, numbers that cannot be numbers that cannot be divided by any other number except one, of course, right? One goes into all the numbers, right? Yeah, primes are those numbers. So that'd be like two and three and five and seven and 11. Um, those are prime numbers. Why did I skip four, for example? Why is, why is four not a prime? Why did I skip six? Six is not a prime. Eight is not a prime. Why not? Why did I skip those? Because two times two equals four, or yeah. two times three equals six. Exactly. Right? We all good? Alexander's got it. We all, we all good right there? Right? So prime numbers are numbers that nothing else goes into. Now, and I skipped nine because three goes into nine. Three times three is nine. Yeah. Anyway. So the answer is this one, isn't it? Because this is the one that's made out of primes and it's multiplied. So that's what you need to understand from the, from the words prime factorization. Factorization means multiplied and prime means uh, numbers that can't break down. See, the problem is this four right here is not prime. And so there we go. There's the prime factorization.